Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into the world of audio transitions in Adobe Premiere Pro. We're going to cover everything you need to know about using and customizing audition transitions so you can make your videos sound as smooth as they look. Let's get into it. First off, let's talk about audio crossfades. These are essential for smoothing out the transitions between your audio clips, just like video transitions do for your visuals. You can apply crossfades to fade audio in or out, or even between two different clips. Let's see how it's done. To add a crossfade, simply place your playhead between two adjacent audio clips on the same track. Right-click on the edit point and select Apply Default Transitions. You'll see a smooth transition added between the clips. Premiere Pro comes with three types of audio crossfade transitions, constant gain, constant power, and exponential fade. Let's set one of these as the default transition. Right-click on either constant gain or constant power in the effects panel, then choose set selected as default transition. This will make it your go-to audio transition. Want to customize your audio transitions further? It's easy. Double-click the transition in the timeline panel to open the effect controls panel and tweak the settings to your liking. You can also adjust the rate of the fade by playing with the clip's audio volume keyframe graph instead of using the transition effect. To fade in or fade out the audio on a clip, simply expand the audio track vertically in the timeline panel. You'll see these visual fade handles. Just click and drag to create different fade effects. Pro tip, hold the option key while dragging to constrain the adjustment to one axis. This means you can control the slope up and down or adjust the duration left to right. You can also hold the shift key to adjust one side for a smooth crossfade effect or hold option and drag to tweak the curve or duration. Now, let's add a crossfade between two clips. Start by expanding the audio tracks vertically to get a better view. Make sure the clips are adjacent and trimmed properly. With the fade handles visible, just click and drag across the adjoining clips to create your custom crossfade. And that's it. You've now mastered adding and customizing audio transitions in Premiere Pro. Whether you're fading in or out or creating smooth crossfades, you've got the tools to make your audio transitions seamless. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more tutorials, and drop your questions or suggestions in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.